hi everyone welcome to day four of our RCN congress so today i'm making this intro from the outside of the hotel where i'm lodging um so far it's been an interesting experience it's been beautiful met lots of people tried to network and to connect yeah and looking forward to what today holds though yeah i'll check in on you guys later and show you what we are up to yeah in the previous video i posted um there was a copyright strike so i had to mute um the sound of one of the music while we were in the hall and dancing it was really a, a, a an interesting um was an interesting scene to be honest but they said that it was blocked so um youtube had to mute the sound but i just hope to you know see you guys later and tell you what we are up to later in the day okay all right we're still here waiting for the shuttle to come and then hope to make the best out of today see you guys soon bye I am aware that I would have to find a HIV status. I would give the information I needed to, but I would also go there and I would face. I would also go there and face whatever consequences were going to come on that night. Regardless of the narrative of my story of HIV, what everybody supported and what everybody realized is that everyone in this room, probably everyone in this world, at some point in their life, had been put into a situation where they feel like they're trapped into a corner. And they need to find their way out. And their only way out is facing against the fear that has already put into the corner. And that was the support I got that day. It was overwhelming towards what I was, what I was saying. But more importantly, what I was doing because everybody understood what it's like to be put into a situation of where you feel like you have to tell the world something that has no definition. It has no definition to what you're capable of. It has no definition to your personality. It has no definition to who you are. But from there on in, people potentially for that, but you're brave enough to want to live authentic that you're willing to take that. Like, that ended up having to have having to disclose the information that I never wanted to, but I felt I had to to do it in the right way. Because trust me, the media who were trying to do it wanted to do it in the way that would amplify the stigma that is already there. They didn't want to do it in a positive way. They wanted to do it in a sensational way that would get people reading, reading papers or reading headlines. In a way, the way I did it to the, to the media was almost kind of boring. <laughs> and Gareth, it, it was amazing that, that bravery that you showed in, in coming out in that way, but equally, the fact that you did it through Praise Man, Fire Man, <laughs> um, was just also a phenomenal symbol of the reality of people thriving with HIV. HIV is very different today than those adverts in the 1980s. And for me, I think that was one of the things that was so compelling. So this is the exhibition center. Every place have theirs. So People are going all around to different venues to speak to them and see what they have in stock. Okay, going to take you around how much I can. Yes, this one. 
guys, this is NMC stand. These people, I think they sell equipment, medical equipment. <laughs> I can see speculum here and all those things. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So. Hello, fresh. You even came here. <laughs> and this is blood transplant and blood donation. Yeah, I know someone I wanted to donate a blood. I'm going to speak to them. There are all these other places. Yeah, so I'm going to go around as much as I can. There is this one. And here are these ones as well. <laughs> Hello. And there is this one too. <laughs> and this one, I think they sell books that produces. And then there is the same heck here. Hello. <laughs> oh. There is Defense Medical Services. These people here are friendly. They are just waving. There is yellow car, MHRA. Yeah, so. And there is me making the video. <laughs> yeah, alright. See you guys later. I'm going to look for the people that I want to look for now. Catch you. I will show you guys other things that we are up to today. Guys, so we are here for the evening event. We are here for the evening event. Yeah, so I will carry you along. Okay, I'll carry you guys along. People are beautifully dressed, and <laughs> let's go and see what the dressing event looks like. Okay, so those. it's a new good place. I'm making a video. <laughs>